Hello everyone, welcome to NG Classes YouTube channel for a video lecture series in control systems. In this video lecture we shall consider a numerical on signal flow graph uh, to find the transfer function of the given signal flow graph using Masson's gain formula. The signal flow graph looks something like this. So let me consider the solution for this. So what shall we do first? So just let me write the solution. So what I have to do is I have to write the Masson's gain formula. So what is that Masson's gain formula? So let me consider writing Masson's gain formula. So let me consider writing Masson's gain formula. So now the transfer function using Masson's gain formula is which is equal to Tk delta k gets divided by delta. So what is k? k is the number of forward paths and t is which forward paths are there. Delta k and delta we will go on finding those things later. So first uh, how many num uh, forward paths are there? So that's we need to f find first. So let me consider writing number of number of forward paths number of forward paths so which is indicated using the letter k which is equal to so now I need to identify how many forward paths are there so just uh, let me check that so if I consider uh, starting from here that is 1 into g1 then g2 and till this point so this is the first forward path and uh, similarly we also have the forward path starting from 1 g3 g4 1 so from input to the output so these are the first two forward paths similarly there are many more forward paths so we'll consider uh, those things first uh, let me write those paths uh, the two paths we have got and uh, moving on further uh, there could be as I said a few more so what is the third uh, forward path there is one more called 1 so just indic let me indicate that this is 1 G1 G6 and moving till here so this is the third forward path similarly there is another one fourth one starting from 1 G3 then G5 till here G2 and 1 so this is going to be the fourth forward path so let me just erase these things yes now ultimately I got the answer as there are four forward paths so using that this equation can be elaborated expanded as T1 into Delta 1 plus we have T2 into Delta 2 then we have plus T3 into Delta 3 then we have plus T4 into Delta 4 so this is what that uh, we have got in the numerator similarly that gets divided by so just let me consider divided by Delta so later we'll find what Delta is that will uh, we can see it later so this gets uh, divided by uh, delta correct so now I need to identify what which are those uh, forward paths t1 t2 t3 so as I already said the first forward path t1 which is equal to 1 into g1 into g2 into 1 so this is the first forward path similarly there is the second forward path which is t2 is equal to 1 into g3 then we have G4 then it is 1 so this is the second forward path similarly moving further there are three more forward paths so let me consider writing those things T3 is equal to as I said earlier uh, which is 1 into G1 into G6 into 1 so it is 1 into G1 G6 G4 into 1 so that is the third forward path so it is 1 into G1 into G6 into G4 into 1 correct so that is the third forward path similarly there is a one more T4 which is equal to 1 into G3 
so we'll check here 1 into g3 into g5 into g2 1 into g3 g5 g2 into 1 so this is the fourth forward path so now we got all the forward paths and now we need to find individual feedback loops and their gains so let me consider writing individual so let me consider writing individual feedback loop individual feedback loops and their gains individual feedback loops and their gains so what are those so let me consider the first feedback loop that is l1 l1 is equal to i can consider minus g2 h1 which is that it is this one minus g2 h1 this is the first feedback loop and i can consider uh, this as the second feedback loop which is minus g3 into h2 h2 so let me write those things l1 i got it as minus minus g2 into h1 similarly i also got l2 l2 is equal to minus g3 h2 and there is another feedback loop l3 so which can be written as g5 into g6 is that fine so this is going to be the one g5 j6 so this is going to be another feedback loop so i would consider that uh, writing as l3 l3 is equal to g5 into j6 similarly there is uh, another one uh, let me consider writing that l4 is equal to so there could be another uh, feedback uh, loop which starts from g4 yes here i am g4 then minus h1 then g6 is that fine so just let me draw that to get the more clear picture starting from g4 minus h2 and coming uh, through g6 to g4 so this is another feedback loop similarly i can consider uh, the next one l5 so l5 could be starting from here g1 and then I have G6 and then with minus H2 so this could be the another uh, feedback loop so let me consider writing those things as L4 and L5 so what did I say for L4 L4 we have minus G4 H1 G6 and lastly I have the feedback loop l5 l5 is equal to minus g1 into j6 into h2 so these are the individual feedback loops and there are uh, and their gains so what is the next thing next thing i have to do two non touching loops so how many two non touching loops are there how many two non touching loops so if I go up and check it is L1 and L2 so this loop and this loop are going to be two non-touching loops <coughs> so here two non-touching loops are L1 and L2 so by knowing all these things now I can write the expression for del which is equal to 1 minus now I need to write uh, the individual feedback uh, loops which are L1 plus L2 plus l3 then i have l4 and then i have l5 so these are the individual feedback loop gains plus two non-touching loops which are those l1 into l2 so after that i have to consider the three non-touching loops but there is no such case so hence i would just stop at this point of time so now for i need to consider to find a delta 1 delta 2 delta 3 and delta 4 first for the path t1 i have to check which loop is non-touching 
if i consider that all the loops are all the for all the forward paths all the loops are touching for t1 all the loops are touching if i consider t2 again all the loops are touching so my conclusion is for for all the forward paths for all the forward paths all the loops are touching so just let me write this all the loops are touching for all the forward paths all the loops are touching so therefore i can write hence delta 1 equal to delta 2 equal to delta 3 equal to delta 4 is equal to 1 so now i have found all the parameters in the maths gain formula that is t1 t2 t3 t4 delta 1 delta 2 delta 3 delta 4 and uh, lastly divided by delta so now i just have to substitute all those things to get the transfer function therefore c of s yes divided by r of s yes equal to so what is there in the numerator in the numerator t1 into delta 1 what is t1 t1 is g1 into g2 so let me consider writing that g1 into g2 plus t2 what is t2 it is g3 into g4 plus then i have uh, t3 what is t3 g1 g4 g6 so let me consider g1 g4 g6 plus t4 what is t4 it is over here g2 g3 and g5 it is g2 g3 g5 so this gets divided by so what is there i have to consider so let me consider uh, this gets divided by i have a long denominator which turns out to be 1 plus so what is there in uh, del that i need to write 1 minus actually it is minus l1 plus l2 plus l3 plus l4 plus l5 so i need to substitute those things so minus into minus it becomes plus g2 h1 so it becomes 1 plus g2 into h1 then there is l2 so it is plus g3 into h2 then i have l3 that is minus g5 into g6 just be careful over here once that is done l4 it becomes plus g4 g6 h1 correct plus the last one l5 which is g1 g6 into h2 so this is there for uh, l1 plus l2 plus l3 plus l4 plus l5 plus i need to write uh, l1 into l2 so what is l1 into l2 l1 is minus g2 h1 l2 is minus g3 h2 i multiply have to multiply minus into minus it becomes plus then i would get g2 into g3 then i have h1 into h2 so ultimately this is the expression for the transfer function uh, using masson's gain formula for this particular numerical i have explained this numerical step by step i hope you people have understood if there are still any doubts please let me know them on to the comment section and i'm happy to answer those uh, doubts thank you so much for watching